How does the appeals process ordinarily conclude? In my experience, the appeals process ordinarily best concludes when a mutually agreed upon settlement position is reached that takes place in a face-to-face -face meeting with the appeals officer and that is reached on the spot. The appeals officer will then proceed to complete form number 870, which is a consent to a proposed assessment, which both parties sign. But be forewarned, once you sign the form 870, you agree to pay the amount of the settlement and you're prohibited from subsequently challenging any of the included settlement terms in tax court. If you feel the Form 870 was prepared in error or doesn't include the terms you thought you agreed to, simply don't sign it. You can then either try and reach an acceptable settlement with the Office of Chief Counsel, which follows on the heels of appeals, or go on to litigate your issue in tax court.